yeah, it's the same as I said afterwards. Um, I thought it was a very good game, first half especially against a very good Hyderabad team. And we, that's exactly what we expected. And the difference in those types of games are making sure that you take control of key moments. And we had some, some very good key moments in terms of goal scoring, especially when it was 1-1, uh, which we didn't take advantage of. And even when we were trailing 2-1, uh, we had some big moments in the game. And we, we just uh, we didn't score. And that's what decides games at this level. And that's uh, the external measures that you know, we are judged upon. So we won't get carried away with that. You know, we're in, a, we're in the same place that this club was this time last season after two games. Um, but it's important that we do make sure we're a little bit more effective in those final third areas. Coach, uh, just a follow-up question. Uh, any injury concerns going into tomorrow's match? No, we're actually in a, a better space than we were in the last one. Um, so we have, Manda has been nursing a slight injury, so hence his non-involvement in the last couple of games. So he's now back and, and available for full selection. Um, Rowling, who picked up a slight injury during pre-season, as we've been trying to get more minutes into him as well. So he now comes back into contention to start. Um, and otherwise, everyone else is, is OK, with the obvious exception of, of Vignesh, who unfortunately got injured in the, uh, the first game of the season. Yeah, I think you, when you, you have to put it into context. You know, there's been a lot of change at this football club over the off-season, both player-wise and staff-wise. And I think getting off to the start that we did was, you know, you couldn't have written that better. Um, but the expectation is that we continue to, to play a certain way and, and it would be great to win every game 3-0, but we, everybody knows that's not the reality of football. Um, so when you put it in the context of whether it's possession-based football or it's attacking football, the result is important, but it's the way we go about the result. And, and I'm convinced if we continue to play the way we have in the last two games, um, that we'll come away with far more results than, than not by changing our style. Um, in terms of ATK, yeah, we've watched their first couple of games and they have recruited extremely well, again, to add to the squad that they had last year. Um, and they've been very exciting to watch, uh, especially in their attacking play. You know, I've had the pleasure of working with the likes of Roy Krishna, um, you know, and, and they have others as well. But again, I'll come back to what I said in the previous two games. It's, it's not so much about them, it's making sure that what we do is, is what we want. Um, so we need to prepare ourselves both in possession and out of possession. Um, to face another good team. And that's what we've, we've been working on the last two days. Yeah, we'll have, a, we'll have a different game plan for different teams. But part of our style and what we want is not just in possession and, and different ways of playing with the ball. It's very important that we're very structured and organised out of possession. And that's part of our style as well. So for some teams, um, if we feel that pressing and pressing teams will get us more success higher up the field, then we'll do that. Uh, but we also need to factor in the, uh, the amount of games that we do have in short spaces of time and the physical demands that are placed upon players when we ask them to do that. So to answer your question, um, it'll be different for different teams, but our possession, how we want to work is very important to our style of football. Yeah, this team doesn't need any motivation. You know, we, we, the, this team won the league and won the double last year. There's no, no motivation needed here. Um, the very experienced players. So in terms of... What do I tell them during the game? Uh, if, you, if you say they looked a little bit lost. Um, we, we've had 60% possession. We've played over 400 passes. We've created seven, what I define as goal scoring moments throughout the game. So if they look lost, then they can still do that. Um, I'm, I'm happy with that because I feel if we approach games in that manner more times than not, we'll certainly come away with more results. Story by Clinton D'Souza for Herald TV.